Shalom. 1 Samuel 26, 9 and 10. But David said to Abishai, Do not destroy him, for who can put out his hand against the Lord's anointed and be guiltless? And David said, As the Lord lives, the Lord will strike him, or his day will come to die, or he will go down into battle and perish. David had two opportunities to kill Saul and replace him, and yet he did not. He respected the man that God had allowed to uh, become king of Israel. Even though Saul was less than competent and not really walking with God, eventually Saul would become irrelevant and David would come to the throne. God will allow events to take place or people to come to prominence uh, and we shouldn't get in his way. It's all good because God has 2020 vision on yesterday, today, and tomorrow. So let's stop having the blind leading the blind and trust the only trailblazer who knows where he is going. Be blessed.